Education cuts leave an Illinois school fed up. Now they're showing the Wabash Valley just how frustrated they are. Good evening, I'm Mark Allen. And I'm Patrice Dayton. Night after night, you hear the same frustrations facing schools. But one school in Illinois didn't want to tell you about their budget cuts, but rather show you. News 10's Kate Green explains how this school found a way to get the word out. If you look at this school in Flora, Illinois, you wouldn't know the trouble this school faces. But take one glance this way, and you can see exactly what's troubling this school district. $387,000 worth of trouble, they say, caused by the state of Illinois. The school says they wanted to show you this sign for three reasons. One, to show you how much money the school needs. Two, to show you how much money the state of Illinois owes them. And three, how much money is affecting your children. Children will see changes in their classroom and in their athletics. I can't help but feel that these kids are being held hostage by the state. I don't think that's fair. Uh, I think our legislators need to roll up their sleeves and do their job for a change. Instead, it's left Superintendent Dr. Gary May to make big changes. He says from teachers to field trips, cuts will have to be made. Here's an example of what they're dealing with this year. Part of the money missing is for the Reading Improvement Grant, a program promised to parents. But now... We have not received one penny of reimbursement in the Reading Improvement Grant. Nothing. And so far, the state has done nothing to change this number here, forcing the school to change the numbers inside there in the coming days. In Flora, Illinois, with photojournalist Ryan Ward, Kate Green, News 10. The Florida Community School Board met this evening to discuss what they'll need to cut or what they need to keep. A final decision is expected to be made tomorrow night at 5.30 Central Time at the district building. Of course, News 10 will continue to follow the story and bring you the very latest.